Welcome to this video on how to use the Kaleidoscope tool in Corel Painter. New to Painter 12, the Kaleidoscope tool is a fantastic way to create a stunning work of art in only a few minutes. In this example, we will be creating an image that absolutely must be symmetrical, and that is a snowflake. Go to File, New, and Create a New Image. Select a canvas size of 900 by 900 and a resolution of 150 dpi. In this example, the background color has also been set to a dark indigo, which will contrast nicely with the white ice crystals. Next, click on the mirror painting tool in the standard toolbar. If you've used the kaleidoscope tool recently, it may already show that icon. Otherwise, you will need to click on it in the interactive properties bar at the top of your screen. When you're painting a snowflake, it's important to remember that although each snow crystal is completely unique, like a fingerprint, they generally share the characteristic of a six-fold symmetry. To prepare for this, make sure that the number of intersecting lines in your kaleidoscope has been set to three. For a nice thick white that resembles snow, click the thick acrylic flat brush from the acrylics brush library. Make sure that the color is set to white. The brush size can vary depending on the style of the snowflake that you're creating. Start by tracing a line of paint up each of the guidelines and end the line in a point. If you have a drawing tablet, you will notice that the pen tip changes as you move your hand on a different angle. As you can see, each stroke is mirrored on either side of the line and is also repeated at two other points on the opposite intersecting lines. To add finer detail, reduce the size of the brush and continue the pattern until you're satisfied with the result. Remember, there are infinite possibilities when it comes to creating snowflakes and there's very little potential for error. When the image is complete, go to File, Save As, and select Riff. This way, if you wish to continue to work on the project at a later time, the kaleidoscope lines will remain intact. To save a version that can be uploaded to Facebook, printed, or sent via email, go back to File, select Save As, and choose JPEG. Thank you for watching this tutorial on the Kaleidoscope tool in Corel Painter 12, and have a safe and happy holiday season!